All right, in this video, I'm going to show you kind of how to get started into using No Limits Roller Coaster. First thing you're going to have to do, go to Start, go to Programs, go to No Limits, and then go to No Limits Editor. When you get into No Limits, as it opens up, it'll give you a tip of the day. Read it, close it, maximize your screen here, and then it kind of gives you a blank canvas. Now I can zoom in by rolling my mouse or I can scroll out. I'm going to get somewhere in the middle here. And then I'm going to start creating my first coaster. Okay, now I'm going to talk about some keys that you're going to have to use on the keyboard in order for this to work. First key is the V key. So if you look at my cursor, when I hit the V key, it actually changes. So now when I click, I can add in different parts of my track, okay, just by clicking. Now, in this program, it won't allow you to actually complete, um, it won't allow you to ride the roller coaster if it's not connected. So to do that, you hit the C button, okay? Um, now, what I just added in is each one of these are vertexes. They're basically different connections uh, to my roller coaster. In between vertexes are called segments, okay? So the roller coaster is made up of a bunch of segments connected by vertexes. So what we need to do is we need to find our starting vertex which is right here and we need to split up our roller coaster now into different segments. To do that I go up and I go up to segment. The first thing I'm going to put in is the station. Okay, stations where all the crowd gathers is where your lines are. Well that goes right in front of this first vertex and I click on the segment and then I press the X key and you'll see that it turns brown right after my station. Okay, I'm going to click and if you think about it, the first thing you usually do is you get lifted up. So I click on that segment, I press X. Right before we end, probably a good thing you need to do is be able to stop. So that is where we put our brake and I press X. And then in between there, and it depends on how your roller coaster is is set up but you need these things called transports. Now transports when I put that in they will either and they they are the or, or excuse me the yellow color but they will either speed up or slow down your roller coaster and it just depends on if if you need it to speed up or slow down you're gonna put in some transports. 